Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of I'm Stealing My Own TV. In the last episode, <laughs> um, we uh, did not have a very good day. Uh, hopefully today, um, we will have good humor and the spirits will give us a little extra luck. Uh, so welcome to Living Off the Land, uh, get your hands a fishing pole and sell your catch. Fishing is a great way to make a little extra cash when you have some downtime. The distance you bobber lands from any dry land determines what kind of fish you'll hook, as well as the location, season, time of day, and weather. So that's actually good information for us to have. So I think the goal for today is going to be to try and recover from losing that progress in the mine if possible. But I think first things first is we're going to try and find some food. Uh, I forgot how to use my controls already. That's fantastic. That hasn't hasn't even been a full week, and I've already forgot how to play. And water all these guys. So I know I sound like I I, I feel like I sound. I guess I should say worse than um, last week. Hopefully, I will be getting this cold or whatever is going on under control. For now, though, I'm just gonna keep uh, recording. And hopefully my voice does not hate me for it. I do, however, have some milk to drink for myself so that I can wet my whistle, as you would say. And hopefully that'll be just enough for us. Also, I'm out of water. Um, we've really got to get a, uh, a sprinkler plan going here, I feel. Just because, uh, yeah, sprinklers would make this actually a lot easier. There you go. All of you guys drink up. Good, good. Okay. Let's go ahead and put you back. And what are we going to go ahead and do? Oh, wait. I almost forgot to water my bean plant. My bean plant. There we go. So I think what we're going to go and do is we're going to go and scavenge around here. Let's see if this has anything yet. Anything? No. Okay. Cool. Just wanted to make sure. Uh, let's go ahead and grab as much acorns, pine cones, and maple seeds as we can. Remember, we don't want to till these up because they are going to be our seed farm. Uh, let's go up here. You're a tr almost a tree. Give me that acorn. And then the two things I'm really uh, having a hard time getting are the maple seeds and the pine cones. So I'm having a really hard time getting right now. Let's go ahead and clear out a little bit of the area around here as well. I mean, it's not going to hurt anything for us to do that, right? Let's get rid of all this stuff. What really sucks is, like, Stardew Valley is supposed to be, like, a really laid-back game, and I'm very, uh... I'm very organized and methodical. Like, I have things down to a plan. Like, it, this is going to take this much time to do this. You need to take care of that. It's actually one of Thunder's main complaints in our, uh, our Versus series because I am quite a bit more organized when it comes to video games and it, it's actually really bad because when things don't go the way I want them to it can actually cause me uh, a little bit of impatience or um, I guess it causes me a little bit of frustration yeah that's what that's what the word I'm looking for so what could, could you ask that could you exit a question please I know I've already used that joke but I like that joke it's funny um pine cone get rid of you all this over here is just like really really bad like we haven't even begun to clear any of this out over here it's going to be like this for a vile okay uh get rid of you get rid of that <clears throat> i am so terribly sorry my voice is just not having a good day anyway so you're gonna have to deal with it i'm gonna have to deal with it we're all gonna have to deal with it is not not a pretty sight uh yes four acorn wish there's an easier way to tell which way i or like where stuff was behind this also goodbye music it was nice knowing you i actually have no idea where all the music went it just got very quiet and awkward it's very awkward in here now do you feel awkward with me bobby so I'm actually kind of worried about uh, Thunder's video that's supposed to go up today. The reason I'm worried about it is uh, his video is not yet uploaded for today. Because uh, I'm recording this on a Wednesday. So this is typically when our Versus episodes go up. And my video is not done uploading after like a good two hours. And I'm still waiting on his to finish. 
or I'm waiting on mine to finish to go ahead and upload his, which is why I'm actually recording Stardew Valley. I'm trying to keep busy while I'm waiting for stuff to do the things. And it is just what I am doing now is playing the waiting game. Ah, there's the music. It's back. It loves us again. Anything else behind here? There is. We are almost out of energy for the day, which kind of worries me. Uh, I don't feel like we've made a lot of, a lot of progress to be out of energy. Okay. All right. So we get some materials to make a field snack. I think we're gonna go and save that though. We don't want to just be like, um, num num, all the food in our mouth. But we're kind of hurting on energy right now. Hmm, what are we going to do for the rest of today? I have acorns, I have those. Am I literally just having a shortage of maple seeds? I think I am. Okay, um, yeah. Shoot. Okay, let's go ahead and actually move the food items together. Let's actually go submit our fish. That'll work. Let's go submit a fish in the fish tank. Goodbye to it. We could also go around and forge a little bit. It's only around 1 p.m., uh, so foraging wouldn't be a terrible idea. Also, goodbye, whatever that was. Actually, I should go shake that tree is what it should do. I ruffled shimmies, guys. Okay, nothing there. Anything here? Nope. It at least doesn't look like it takes energy to rustle trees, which is nice. So I was actually uh, talking again with a, a friend, Astro. I'm not sure if I've actually mentioned him on the channel yet. But he's actually been giving me some advice on Stardew Valley. Like how I should definitely like get the mayonnaise machine stuff working, which means we need chickens. Oh, I'm so glad I could speak. Uh, river fish? Oh, there you go. Enjoy your new home. There's a bulletin board in here. You know, this place is, like, really, really creepy. Also, giant safe. This place is really creepy. <laughs> I wonder if, like, all these rooms have their own little thing to get repaired, and they probably do. Also, I did apparently did not figure out until, like, just now that you could scroll wheel. That, that's good. Do any of these... None of these are readable? Nope. So this is a pantry spring crops bundle. It's a green bring cauliflower and potatoes. Oh, I, I need the parsnips, right? All right. So those should be grown tomorrow, I would think. That's what I'm hoping. We'll complete a little bit more, and a little bit more of this place will be restored. I like how this is like taking a long period of time to get this done. By the way, because it's like the, it's a 22nd of the month. Like it is really. Come out of the bush. I'm another bush, didn't you? Uh, but no, yeah, it's taking a long period of time to get any work done on that. Also, rock? Shoot. Okay, I gotta be very careful. I don't need to exhaust myself. Actually, I might... <laughs> as disgusting as it sounds, I might eat these daffodils. Just to keep myself from being too exhausted for tomorrow. Because you can actually, um, your exhaustion from one day can actually uh, go over to the next day. So we want to keep that from happening. And our little energy bar here was sweating it a bit. Mmm. Hey, Louis. It's a good season to start thinking about gardening. Even uh, for us non-farmers. Okay. Help wanted. I want to put a diamond on a chain. Please serve it sometime today, Alex. Eh. Do I have a diamond? I can see if I got one, but I doubt it. As far as I'm aware, there's actually no penalty for accepting the quests if you can't complete them. So that's not bad, at least. Running back to my house to see if I have any diamonds, which probably do not. Let's see, diamond, diamond, diamond. I have a frozen tear. Would you like a frozen tear? Yeah, definitely no diamonds in here. Well, shoot, actually, what's that in the back? Oh, quartz, okay, fair enough. Hmm, 
Well, we do have a little bit of time left in the day today. Um, I almost went over there and was like, ooh, seeds, I'm num 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 with my face. Um, but because we do have a little bit of time, I'm going to try and go down here and forge and hopefully we'll find some other stuff. Maybe we'll just steal someone's kidneys. You never know. There we go. Wild horseradish. Dandelion. I like how we are literally so... Well, we're not poor. But we're so hungry that we're just stealing plants out of the ground and eating them. Om nom nom nom. Oop, yep. Spring onions are back. I'll take these. Don't mind myself. Thank ya. Mmm, yay. I wonder if I, like, let these grow, like, they would just continue to, uh, like, expand the ground. Oh, too late for them now. I'm picking them all. Ha ha ha. That wasn't a bad find. It wasn't the best find either, but it wasn't a bad find. Anything else down here? Anything else at all? No? Okay. Well, I don't think that was actually a bad haul for today. Not at all. All right, guys, well, I'm probably going to go ahead and call it here soon for this episode. Um, I do want to know what you guys thought of Raft. Uh, that should have gone up the day before yesterday and then yesterday as well. Um, I would like to know a little bit what you guys said about Raft. Um, I'll try and remember to put a card in here, like right, right there, up in the corner, uh, saying, hey, go check out the first episode of Raft, or maybe I'll make a playlist for it. I don't know yet. Um, but yeah, I would really like to know what your guys' feedback is on that. Um, it's actually the first indie game I've ever tried doing before, and I'm hoping everyone likes it. Alright guys, uh, well let's go ahead, clear out our inventory. <clears throat> My throat is hating me. Uh... Alright, let's settle down for bed, even though it's kind of early in the evening still. But either way guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Stardew Valley. If you did, hit that like button. If you'd like to see more, go ahead and subscribe. Either way, my name is Thalon, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!